it, it's one part of the, the extraordinary story of yours. Uh, another is the fact that in between coaching an international rugby team, uh, you're also John Dobson, the novelist. Yeah, um, that's probably my biggest passion is writing uh, is writing fiction, and uh, yeah, I've got a couple of novels. The first one sold out. Uh, I don't think I printed many. But <laughs> Eight <laughs> dozen copies gone in a month. Actually, it was published by Penguin, which is the same author. So I share the same stable as Jane Austen. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, um, just sort of, uh, the second one. No, it is. Uh, it's, it's it's sort of satirical humour about. Um, the society we live in. Uh, please, uh, it's, about a f it's a series about um, a please with himself, fellow smarmy, please with himself, fellow. You have a lot of thanks for the inspiration, Dan. Thank you, uh, Called Jason <laughs> Bryden, who uh, cruises through life and just how obsessed he is with what logos on your shirt and no appreciation of the, what this country's been through, which I think some of our society are, all the traumas that we've been through and no appreciation of the spirit of forgiveness that's been shown in this country. So that's what that's, but it meant to be in a humorous way. Oh, there we go. There we go. The yeah. year of the Gherk in the year Another of the turnip. Two. And now the year of the beetroot coming out. Which again, thank you for the inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> so that's on its way, the year of the beetroot? Yeah, it's finished, but I, I, I've got to get fired by Western Province first before publishing, because if they publish okay, so while, while I'm coach, I will get fired. All right, so it's yeah. out pretty soon then. Yeah, it's done. It's done. <laughs> 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 Too <Touché. laughs>